Zombies. The undead scourge. The flesh-eating, soulless hordes of once upon a time humans and animals. Countless video games, films, and TV series have featured these mindless and rabid hordes as the centerpiece of horror, chaos, and even world domination. Thus, it comes as no surprise that play-to-earn game developers would want to use these frightening creatures as the main focus of an epic survival game. Enter the best and most fun zombie survival game of them all, Undead Blocks, the world's first premier kill-to-earn first-person zombie shooter game. In this game, you'll earn rewards every day by killing zombies using guns that are minted into NFTs. They're called Weapon Loadout NFTs. Welcome back, Metaverse Monopolists. I am not a financial advisor. This video exists solely for educational entertainment. Please make your own researched financial decisions. Now, Undead Blocks is a multiplayer zombie survival game, whereby players collect weapons and slay endless waves of zombies in an immersive first-person shooter experience. As a play-to-earn game, it features weekly leaderboards and challenges that you will have to participate in to earn gold Z-Bucks, a native token of the game, which can be exchanged for other cryptocurrencies, and can also be used to acquire rare and limited edition in-game items and weapons. Oh no! The zombie virus is spreading! Save yourself by hitting that subscribe button! Now, in Undead Blocks, your playing characters are referred to as survivors, and the team behind the game classified its utility tokens in two separate ways. There are Gold and Standard Z-Bucks, whereby Standard Z-Bucks is used to level up the survivor's weapon loadout NFTs and build equity in the assets that you own in the game. The team behind Undead Blocks is aiming at bringing back the nostalgia enjoyed by FPS zombie shooters of the past, by providing players with a thrilling and unique gaming experience. Not only that, but also by allowing players to earn in-game rewards and build equity in their weapon loadouts. Weapon loadouts are valuable assets in this game, and the means of obtaining them is very unique. As a player, you will obtain weapon loadouts by minting them via the program called Stake to Mint. However, you can still directly purchase loadouts on secondary NFT markets, such as OpenSea. You can also obtain these NFTs by becoming a scholar via another program called Gasless Lending, which is featured in the in-game marketplace. Since you're watching this video, you must like to earn by playing crypto games. If so, be sure to check out our favorite crypto gaming ecosystem using the link in the description. Then, let's shortly highlight the Undead Blocks gameplay. To earn in this game, as you play you will have to look out for Z-Box on the map, which are containers that hold valuable and important tokens and materials inside notably gold Z-Bucks. So, to hasten your earnings, you will have to choose the play to earn mode, where you will have to ensure that your weapon loadout is secured, at which point you will get full access to the Undead Blocks experience. After being granted full access to the game, you will get perks of earning both standard and gold Z-Bucks at a much faster rate than in free to play mode. The game offers various playing modes, like Solo, Squad, and many more are expected to be implemented in the future. Some modes are survival-based, and others are speed-based. Nevertheless, in all game modes, the mission is to kill as many zombies as possible. Notably, every zombie killed has a chance to drop a Z-Box, which contains a random amount of gold or standard Z-Bucks inside. And these crates are in all modes of the game. A peculiar fact about gold Z-Bucks, these tokens are pegged to be exactly one cent. Now, let us talk about Stake to Mint, as mentioned before. Well, Stake to Mint simply means that you stake your undead tokens to be allowed to mint a weapon loadout for free. This is also a unique style of staking because as an undead token staker, not only do you earn APY rewards for staking, but you will also have the opportunity to mint a weapon loadout for free upon token lock to use immediately within the undead blocks ecosystem. But why mint weapon loadouts? Well, once you mint these NFTs, they become your property, whereby you will not only get the opportunity to fully play the game, but you can also earn passively, lend them, or sell them. You may be confused about which is the standard governance token of the Undead Blocks ecosystem out of the Undead token, Standard Z-Bucks, and Gold Z-Bucks tokens. Notably, the Undead token is the governance token, and the token is available in both centralized and decentralized exchanges. That's to say, Undead Blocks features a dual token system like in Hero Blade, which is an awesome mobile wave clearer NFT game. Tap the tab on your screen to learn more about how to get started. 
Additionally, drop your take in the comment section concerning undead blocks, and we'll see you inside the metaverse.